What's your most embarrassing thing that's happened to you in life? <laughs> Let me detail it. I'm embarrassed myself. Um, it was in college. Okay. What college? I went to Christ King College. Oh, right, Lewisham? Yeah. yeah. Christ King College, though. <laughs> um, I think it was my second year. Um, and I wanted to, like, some, someone had asked me to go and do, like, a little dance set with them, basically. But it wasn't really choreographed or anything like that. And I wasn't the best dancer back in the world, back in the day when I was in college. So I was like, still not the best dancer, but again, as I said earlier, my personality kind of got me places. So it is what it is. Doesn't matter how good you are. Your personality gets you everywhere. Just, just be a nice person. Doesn't really matter. Um, so me and this girl was like, oh yeah, we're going to do this dance, blah, 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 blah. We're going to sub it to you and then we're going to sub it to me. We're going to sub it to you and we're going to sub it to me. The day comes up for the, for the thing now. We come on stage, I'm frozen. You've got about 600 kids in front of me. And you have to understand, this is a bunch of 16, 17, and 18 year olds. I've absolutely bombed on stage. The girl, that, the girl that's next to me is eating me up, man. Her performance is amazing, man. Like, she's doing her thing. Eating, man. Up. My performance is shit. There was no claps. What, it was just there bad? Was no cheers. It was just terrible. Absolute nerves got to me. I weren't the greatest dancer. Absolutely terrible about 600 kids just watching me. You see, when I walked out that assembly, yeah. do you think anyone even gave me an eye contact? Like they even cared? They were just like, nah, bro, we didn't even, like, what is that? Man? <laughs> we didn't, we didn't, we didn't, like, it's so shit, we ain't gonna comment on it. We're just gonna move forward. We're just gonna forget that shit happened. That's really one of the most embarrassing moments. But do you know what that taught me? That I really don't care about what people think about my performance. I'm, Anything in front of somebody eventually will be good. So, I'll give you a prime example. There's a YouTube channel where a person puts stuff on a chair and sits on it. Thousands of views. Thousands? Thousands of views. He just puts stuff on the chair? Just puts stuff on the chair and he sits on it. Sits on the stuff? Yep. Wow. Thousands of views. <laughs> And do you know what the whole moral of that story is? You're not necessarily shit. I mean, you might be shit, which in my case I was. You might not necessarily be shit. It's just that your content hasn't reached its audience yet. Okay. Is that because you're doing it wrong? No. It's just it hasn't reached its audience yet. So I'll give you a prime example. Let's say, for example, there's 100 people that can potentially see your content. You put it out and only one person watches it to the end of the end but the person that needs to like your content is at the 100th mark. Your content just hasn't reached that person yet. You get it? You just haven't reached it yet. Doesn't mean your content is shit. It might be shit, but even if it's shit, it just hasn't reached the right person yet. Cause you can go viral fucking anything. 